Well, it's a great read, but nothing about that. I know that symbol. How? It shows up sometimes in Sumerian ritual magic. There's a statue on loan at the museum that features it. What does it represent? Just a symbol. Signifies a path to obtain great power. Most of my colleagues assume it's an old constellation. No constellation I ever saw. And I used to tell fortunes on Coney Island. Is that right? Did you wear a turban? No, man. A red velvet cape with moons. It was plush. Get this. The Codex does indicate there is some kind of feeder system required to channel energy to a destructor form. A destructor form? Like Stay Puft? It's entirely possible that system and this pattern are connected. It's possible. Wait, you said the Gozerian statuary at the museum is on loan. From whom? Evo Shandor, the architect. Well, the Shandor Foundation. They control Shandor's remaining estate and holdings. Evo is a big collector of Gozerian artifacts. By Evo Shandor the architect, you mean Evo Shandor the genocidal maniac, right? That's what I was researching when Gozer attacked me. Shandor's architecture firm was involved in a number of projects around town in the late 18, early 1900s. Including Dana Barrett's old building on Central Park West. You mean the one with the extra-dimensional antenna that drew Gozer to our world so he could attempt to destroy it? He had a nice view of the park, though. Yes, but he also did some renovations on existing buildings and a number of public works. There was controversy, because a lot of people thought the work was unnecessary. Let me guess. He did some renovations on the public library building on 5th. Right. And the Museum of Natural History. Recent visitations, specific localized paranormal activity, singing Vikings. They're all connected to Shandor and this pattern. We should warn the mayor. I don't know, he's likely to just sick peck on us even more. You should get a closer look at the museum. Well, the mayor is going to be at the museum for the exhibitioning opening gala tonight. It's where I need to be too. Elissa, you sure make work fun for me. Is business casual okay? I don't have a tux. Are you kidding? He doesn't want you guys within three city blocks of the museum tonight. He thinks you make his campaign contributors nervous. Besides, that peck guy will be at the party too. Okay. Egon will stay here and finish analyzing the data from the library. The rest of us will go in by the service entrance of the museum and lay low. Peter can attend the party as Alyssa's guest and stay in plain sight of Peck. And that frees us up to check out the rest of the building. I love this plan. It's just dull enough to work. Ill, I'm going to bring you a corsage. Yes, we just arrived at the loading dock. Keep Peck distracted. We're going to poke around. Okay. I'll take one for the team. No sign of the curator. Alyssa told me he'd meet us right here. Something wanted out of this box in a big way. Watch out. Black slime. Uncheck. Can eventually open a full interdimensional portal. Open doorway. Anything that wants to can come through. If a full portal has been opened, it has to be sealed using your slime blower. That's the key reason we developed that deck. Door sealed shut. Somebody find the power.
Good work, Eagle Eye. Look at this. Something's trail packing material down the hall here. Packing material and slime. That a possessor? Maybe. Looked like a level seven or above, too. Didn't we used to fight class twos and threes every now and then? What happened to them? They were easy. Ah, the good old days. I'm more worried that she'll stir things up around here. I expect we'll see her again sooner than we want her. Hello? Who's in there? Somebody that wants out is who? Oh, Dr. Rutherford. Uh, Z, meet the assistant curator of the museum. Is that horrible, terrible thing gone? Yeah, she's gone. You good? I, uh, yes, I suppose so. I'm a big fan. I even had you over for my daughter's birthday a couple years ago. Is that so? Yeah, well, I think we can get you up. Sticker or button or mug or t-shirt or something when we're done here. Oh, that would be wonderful. Follow me. We'll go through the restoration department. There it is again! Don't let it get me! Don't you worry. She'll have to go through me first. Not to come aboard. Can you help them? Hold him down, young blood! You guys are really good! Voila! That's fusion-based exorcism in a nutshell. Cleaner than somebody's head spinning all around in barfing pea soup. Will he be okay? How you doing, Ray? How's it buzzing? How's it buzzing? Buzzer was it? Oh, he'll be fine in a second. After you. Oh no, if this place is possessed by possessors, we'd better get to Peter fast. Bankman, we found the curator. We're on our way to the Gozer exhibit now. There's so much in setting up that exhibit. Well, hello there. Dig it, Peter. Ray got possessed again. Ah, Z! You'll have to go through me first. <laughs> That's exactly what he said. Just like a puppy, every day's the first day. Ghostbusters ejected from this facility immediately. Where's his honor, Pecker? We've got news for him and a photo op. The mayor is indisposed right now. Anything you need to tell him goes through me. Not happening, Peckley. This is for Jock. Jock. Security! Remove these men. 
with excessive force. Why do the good ones always play hard to get? What in the hell is going on here? <laughs> they got hit. No, I, ne I never got hit. More possessor ghosts. Kid, you know what to do. Great. Mm -hmm. You know what, Doctor? over, folks. Clear the room. <laughs> Hurts, doesn't it? Let it all out. I'll see you all on Rikers Island for this. Whoa, take a break. Do you ever shut up? <laughs> oh my god! They're attacking the guest! Here, get your coat quickly. <laughs> All right, you guys go after Alyssa. Be careful. I'll get to security. I love this plan. I'll man the security cameras to triangulate them on the monitors and talk you through. See you soon, Ray. Let's go, guys. See you soon, guys. Dr. Rutherford, if you'll show me to security.
here, Fatal. the big 10-4. Hittite, Mennonite, Phoenician, Babylonian, Assyrian, Aryan. Ah, he's making it all up. Just one of those things. Ah, you pick this stuff up. You know, around the office. Peter, come in. Hi, honey. How was your day? Man, we've reached the security office. This one is a shambles. It's been sabotaged. Black slime all over the place. Only a few of the cameras are still working. When you're free, no rush. Open gate 3487, just for kicks. Give me a minute. Oh, we're under attack. We'll get back to you. Ray, stay away from any possession. Um, Dr. Rutherford, if you're still there, can you go catch Dr. Stance, please? I shook off that possessor. Found a different security room. Can't find Dr. Rutherford, though. I must have scared him off. You're not pretty when you're possessed, Ray. Seriously. I've got you on the cameras. You should be coming to the Civil War exhibit. Alyssa just passed through there. Okay, we're on it. Thanks.
You know the difference between this exhibit and the other ones? The soldiers in this one have guns. Let's just pass through here as quickly as we can. And yeah, I just want to do it. Just thinking happy thoughts. Like a little Vicksburg snow globe. Yep, they took some casualties. Maybe they're just props, but those barrels are marked explosive. We made it to the security office. I can see you guys on the cameras. No sign of Alyssa or her kidnappers, though. In the early 1900s, the museum was run by a board of trustees. Powerful guys, tycoons, captains of industry. The chairman of the board was Cornelius Wellesley of International Steel. The board used the museum as a respectable front for all kinds of dubious activities. Mainly, though, they were part of a club run by our favorite evil architect. 
They hired women from the St. Nicholas Rehabilitation Mission for Wayward Angels. Rumor has it the board conducted all kinds of nasty rituals using these women. We've got to find that oozing tub of blubber and Alyssa. Well, here we are, the Egypt exhibit. I practically lived here while I was working on my dodge. That was the best black slime here! That's a whole lot of what ever. On your left! Hey folks, it's okay. Be calm. Everything's under control. It's the Ghostbusters! Ghost! Get away! Get away! Watch it now. Yeah, of course. The trap locks us in with the ghost. Wouldn't it be nice to get locked out every now and then? Get out of the Egypt exhibit. The main door is blocked up tight. The Egyptian main room? Check the west wall. There should be a door leading through to the next exhibit. I'm looking right at the west wall and I don't see a door. Well, I'm looking right at the blueprints and, uh, oh, I get it. Clever. The ghosts used their own dimensionally anomalous signatures to slightly wrinkle the time-space continuum. The door is still there. What you're seeing is a fold in reality. The ghosts removed the door from this plane of existence. All I'm seeing in the pair of goggles is a kind of glowing purple aura. No door. 
Well, this is an educated guess, but since the ghosts are gone, their influence is fading. The anomaly should straighten itself out. A few hours, probably. A few hours? But I gotta... go! Wish I could help you, Z. But any analysis at this point is strictly theoretical. Okay. But the biological situation I'm experiencing is not theoretical at all. Hmm. I suppose in theory, mind you. Positively charged slime could dissipate the wrinkle and restore everything to its... Just slime the damn thing? Good. Thank you very much. Now let's get the hell out of here. Where'd Peter go now? Let's get him!
Gonna have to watch out for you. Hey guys, did you find Alyssa? Where did that ghost go? You didn't see him, but he just came through here. He must be headed back to the world of Gozer exhibit. That's our cue? We move it. What a nightmare. Thank you. Not the words that rescuing hero wants to hear from his damsel in distress. May I say, your eyes are much prettier when they're not glowing like hot coals. Peter, I've made an extraordinarily frightening discovery. Why don't you all go away? All my data indicate that the ghost world is beginning to push through multiple cross portals from their dimension into ours. Well, more overtime. Guys, look! <laughs> My name is... Block the exits! Don't let him escape with her! Hit him with slime! <laughs> Winston, get the lady out of here before he hits... Like to have that superpower. Care to tell me why my library, museum, and parade are all going down the toilet? I keep telling you, sir, the Ghostbusters are nothing but scam artists determined to throw a negative light on you and the city and extort you for more money. Hello, Peck. I own that suit in blue. Both of you, pipe down! Mr. Mayor, an enormous event is on the horizon. Something at the museum exhibit triggered a systemized psychic occurrence. Some mechanism we don't know the nature of yet. No, of course you don't. But it's feeding enormous energy somewhere. Something that's now in the process of breaking down the walls between our world and another one. This other world is crossing through into ours. It started with simple ghosts and animated monsters. Now it's getting bigger. We don't know exactly what's next, but there's only room for one city here in this dimension. Two physical worlds can't exist in the same space. That's just elementary particle physics. We got a glimpse of the other world, Jock. It ain't pretty. It's like Brooklyn and the Bronx with no queens in the middle. Whole city blocks sinking into a fifth dimensional abyss. Cockroaches the size of polo ponies. Panic in the streets. How'd you like disco to come back? Bigger than ever. I get it. We're in trouble. So what am I supposed to do? We need to prepare the city for the worst. The city's my responsibility, not yours. Now go do your job and stop that thing. You got a bite on your PKE. Scan around for something paranormal with your goggles. way, gentlemen. Well, this looks inviting. I'll be at the office watching over Alyssa. Don't do anything fun without me. Trail. This way. It probably goes without saying, but this is very strange. Well, that is your conversation story. What's strange? This tunnel network, what could it possibly have been built for? I was thinking 
the same thing. Well, it could just be an old steam tunnel. No way, Peter. The design and valves don't fit for moving steam, water, gas, electric, oil, trains, not even slime. What about Morlocks? Morlocks would hate this kind of ornamentation. I don't recognize the alloy fabrication. This way, with me. So it's not steam, it's not more locks, but there's plenty of go. You're right about that. There's more consistent accelerated PKE blowing through here than I've ever seen. But this is not the origin point. This is just a conduit. Look at the trail! The chairman went that way! He's running down this tunnel! Question is, where does it lead? Does it feel weird in here to you guys? Like familiar weird? Well, we knew which way to go for a while at least. There's got to be another way around this. The trail leads to this sealed door, then stops. Man, I do not want this jerkball to get away again. Yeah, that was a little harsh. What'd you have against that wall? The new cadet's all right. Well, so far, not too shabby. Egon, I think this is as good a time as any to install a new CPS. The Mizan Collider is extremely precise and deals a lot of damage, but takes a while to recharge. The Overload Pulse disperses a rapid burst of Mizan particles. You can fire each of them independently. They both work great. But you can also use them in tandem. Paint a target using the Mizan Collider. After you've acquired the target, all expulsions from the Overload Pulse will home in on that target. 